It's Tuesday, the 3rd of February, 5 to midnight. And we're starting down in the cellar this time because, well, the cellar's been neglected for a while, hasn't it? Uh, we did a bit of a clean-up yesterday because this had become a dumping ground, all the tools and there was material and all sorts of stuff. As we were finishing off bits upstairs, they were all just being dumped down here. So, yeah, we put a bit of order onto the place. At least got things back onto the shelves instead of lying over the floor. And I'm having to move my, my uh, makeshift workshop down here, the chop saws here, the... Uh, the, the workmate, the, the router and jigsaw and all have to come down yet uh, because basically upstairs is almost finished um, and I don't want to be creating too much dust uh, sawing floorboards and stuff upstairs um, but we'll see that in a moment when we go up so essentially yeah because we we're going to be moving in fairly soon this place had to be sorted out so we're, we got our dryer there and uh, yeah everything is ready for the uh, the washing machine it's been sitting in the barn for the past three years. Um, has to move in. We just need to get the wiring finished, so the, the socket's done for that. And uh, yeah, it's looking okay. Still a bit of a dumping ground here. Uh, this all has to be tidied up. And uh, that'll be the beer cellar. Um, I've got beer to put in it, but uh, yeah, I think it still needs a bit of work. Here's still a bit of a dumping ground, but still a lot better than it was a week ago. And as we're going by, and the landing area here, and this is what I started working on uh, yesterday evening uh, to get the flooring done here. I'd be kind of leaving that to last because it's a bit awkward with the uh, with the stairwell and stuff. And the railing has got a bit of a paint job as well, uh, so just a matte black, and uh, no more goldy swirly things. Green handrail still a bit meh. But uh, we're going to live with it for a while. We'll probably get to like it. Uh, but someday I'd love to swap that out for something uh, made of wood. Last bit of painting still to be done here. Uh, bathroom, I think. There's been no change since last time. Um, no, there's been no change since last time. Still a bit of jobs to do. Uh, our shower doors arrived. There they are lying in the middle of the room uh, during the week. So uh, maybe by the end of this week they'll be up. And um, actually today, speaking of having a shower and stuff, because uh, you can basically look right out into the middle of the village there, and uh, I don't think they want to be seeing my naked body after we move in. So uh, I'm considering either some sort of uh, foil that you stick on uh, to make it like a milky glass, or uh, we were looking today at uh, kind of blinds, but kind of awkward windows for blinds, but we need some sort of solution. But we've 20 windows that need that, so it's gonna be, yeah, costing a bit. Uh, the stairs got a uh, sanding, uh, so that'll uh, just need to be varnished a bit. And then the big changes up here. I think the last video, uh, which is what, eight or nine days ago, um, I'd shown this area which we just finished painting and the window seals were in. And uh, I spent a few days last week then getting the flooring down. Kind of awkward because there's lots of cutting kind of nicky nacky areas and the steps so uh, because the beams up here are kind of all yeah bent for want of a better word and um, there's lots of kind of high points and if we chose the high point as uh, as a kind of zero uh, for this level we would have been losing quite a lot of height in the room so we put these steps in which made it a bit interesting doing the uh, doing the flooring but oh, I kind of enjoyed it too so I think it looks quite well uh, whatever bits of trim and all that still needs a bit of an oiling where the wood was cut and sanded and stuff and yeah the the handrails well something needs to be done with that for sure the original handrail for the stairs we we took out um when i was taking you know basically this the cladding and all that was here apart so uh that needs to be cleaned up and somehow reinstated and uh yeah, my workshop for doing the flooring was in here, so uh, about two hours ago this was just a mess of sawdust and offcuts and uh, then our friend Satya arrived with his compressor and nail gun to start putting the rope trimming down, so we decided we'd go with the rope trimming all around here instead of a mix of um, kind of skirting board and rope trimming and uh, I think it looks really well, I'm really happy with it. So this room is actually done. 
you know, there's actually the only thing that needs to be done is the, the lights, but we can live with the bare light bulbs for quite a while. And uh, the doors are the only things that are, well, it's the only thing that's missing now. And we were looking at doors this afternoon. And um, yeah, I got some prices, some of them are scary. So uh, maybe we'll try and reinstate some of the old doors. Well, we've only got one nice door, uh, but maybe we can make that fit. And uh, at least we need something for the bathroom in the short term. But if it takes eight weeks between ordering a uh, full set of doors, because uh, they're awkward sizes, and getting them uh, delivered, we need some solution. Uh, and then, uh, was it yesterday? No, oh, yesterday, day before yesterday, I spent two days basically uh, flooring this room. And uh, yeah, my wife has now said this is the the best room in the house so it's certainly the, the warmest friendliest colors my son picked out the colors like kind a of honey yellow and um, this is a, a yeah a plaster that you basically roll on strike puts uh, that has a bit of a texture to sand in it and uh, yeah I think it's quite nice makes a nice warm feel and with the floors down it's really kind of inviting so we got the rope trim down here as well and uh, yeah, a lot, a lot has happened in here actually in one week. Uh, so the only thing missing is a windowsill, which I have to make still. And then this room is also finished, apart from the door, of course. So yeah, lots and lots have been done in the past uh, week and a half. And uh, we could move in on Saturday maybe or over Sunday. Um, I'm tempted to leave it another week just because uh, I'd like to make sure that all the kind of dirty work is done. And the other thing is that telecom were supposed to move our phone line, I said in the last video, and uh, they didn't come and they're not telling me why, uh, which is really annoying, because uh, without the phone line, I can't move my office, uh, which also yeah, messes up our schedule quite a bit. So anyway, we'll struggle on and uh, won't talk about that much more, uh, but we're getting there. Uh, certainly looking like a finished house now i'll finish the floorboards uh, this week and uh, get the showers doors in try and sort out the wiring with uh with satya in the cellar and uh let's see what happens at the weekend and uh yeah stay tuned <laughs>